So we're in Anne Company, which is underneath Avenue HQ, uh, right on the front in Man Island. So if you're ever around, check it out, have something to eat, etc., etc. We're really pleased to be here. We're drinking here a little bit too much, if we're all honest about it. But I was anyway, here yesterday. <laughs> you've been here yesterday. Uh, the people were there earlier in the week. And uh, we're here now, though, uh, and we're talking about uh, Neuhaus. You went off, you got your second dose. And you've come back out. <laughs> and Liverpool are buying Neuhaus. Strongly rumoured. What, what's, what's your view? About my dose. How about your dose? How about my dose, for the, um, I keep calling him Manuel. He's Florian. Florian oh, yeah. Neuhaus. He, uh, his dad used to be in craft work. That just get that joke out of the way. I mean, it's one that teenagers. so many people are going to get. <laughs> All the games who came for the FIFA. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. Let's yeah. not pretend. Let's not pretend. This is this, it's just kids watching this. <laughs> oh, there's lots. There's a few of, veterans. Yeah, there's a lot, lots of craft work aficionados as well. There's a few well. early electro dudes out there. Let's, let's not. Do, but well, yeah, but this is so typical. I, I spent. A lot, well, a fair bit of the morning just scrolling Twitter, knowing I'm doing a gutter show tomorrow and I need to have my finger on that pulse. And then I, I piss off to get vaccinated or dosed up. For, and then it's all breaking around me. Because we all had this one nailed down as he was going to buy Munich. He's been yeah. linked for a good few months. And he's fucked them off? Well, we don't know that yet. Mm. This could trigger Bayern Munich's intentions, couldn't it? Wh wh where's the where's the link come from? Is it from the Goodfellas or? No, it's 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 a it's decent. Yeah, yeah, it's decent. It's, it's your main man from Bill just ticked it and went, yeah, this the is the Bill fella who was all Tiago last year, Christian yeah. Falk, Peter's lad. <laughs> and a guy called Florian Pettenberg was the first to break it, and Falk gave him the the tick. Florian Pettenberg also in craft work. Yeah. Um, yeah, so there you go. All the synth lads are on it, Johnny. All the synth lads. Well, it, it, it's great, was, from my perspective, if we can get one over Bayern Munich, it's great for Klopp, and Klopp's had his, like his best lads diddle off him for true, years yeah. and years, and then if we get those crazy bastards back after all this time, it'd be great. Yeah, I think I, I think they need to do, I think they need to do a midfielder, I think they need to do someone who's under 25. The, the fellow supposedly Did, really... let's, let's imagine I don't know who he is. So he's What's so, his profile? He's 24, John. He's 24. He's a, 24. <laughs> he's a centre midfielder. Who's, he's in the German squad, so he's going to the Euros. He's meant to be, the, the expectation is he's going to play. He's oh, going to get on good. the pitch. So we can watch him then. Do you want to go kids as well this year? I've known that. Well, they always do, though, don't they? Yeah. That's do not let those boys down. Yeah. Uh, therefore, them year in, year out. Uh, he's meant to be really tidy, really pe press resistant, not dissimilar right. to Genie. Works hard, not a ton of goals in him, not dissimilar, at least for us, to Genie. Um, it does all feel a little bit like, like he's a centre mid, centre mid is, I mean, I've only, I think I've probably only ever seen him play twice. Let's cool up my jet here, that's what, like, I know what I'm talking yeah. about. The Anfield rapper tweeted a really nice pass from him uh, in the Champions League this season. Um, just one of them, oh, jet, jet out style, uh, on across the, across the floor. He scored, uh, eight, he scored eight, I, I just checked Yeah, it. he's got a good long shot on him as well, I've seen a bit of that. For a centre yeah. mid. Yeah, more we, more we, than we got from Genie, isn't it? Well, well more, yeah. But all Genie's counted double because they were all massive. They were all huge. <laughs> <laughs> Against the biggest teams in the world, yeah, at yeah. the most important moments. I, I, I think we could be in real trouble if we have to play that Martian 11 without Genie. <laughs> <laughs> he would absolutely have splattered the Martian scruffs, but we're, we're going to have to find a way to cope. I think Genie's numbers are probably three goals a season for five seasons every season at every each three with the biggest goal of yeah, that season. With, 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 a dozen, with a dozen yeah, for yeah. Holland at the same time. Yeah. That slightly sticks in the cross. <laughs> It'll be interesting to see how many gets for PSG. If he yeah. scores a lot, I'm not going to be happy. I can't lie about it. So, sort of like little things like all of them are massive. I was doing some research on something uh, Chelsea 16-17 uh, this morning and like I was checking if we did the double over them because they won the league but Henderson scores at their gaff before they get good then they go on the man's run and then they come to Anfield and we draw 1-1 uh, they go 1-0 through David Luiz Genie gets the equaliser yeah. and you're like oh, for fuck's sake what that one as well he that's scores Mignolet's all fault. the massive ones yeah yeah but I'm sorry to drop. but that's the one Mignolet just is, is busy uh, tapping things on his post as Luiz bends <laughs> I've had a, you know, I was much. very drunk at that game. <laughs> I, I, I think I've t I may have told this story once before, so apologies. Tell it again. I'll but, tell uh, stories 12 times. So, so we, we, we'd we been for a bevy actually in, in oh, Hushing Town. Early doors, like about half four. Remember they used to have that big tank of yeah. Krusevich beer? So we were drinking that for about half three, four o'clock. Eight o'clock kickoff. Um, I can't remember if it was a Monday night or a midweek game, I can't remember. But it was, I'd been to work and I'd been drinking the heavy duty gear. Yeah. And um, our, our mob started arriving a little bit late and Chris Maguire turned up about seven o'clock, really annoyed that he wasn't as pissed as we were. <laughs> so just as we got to the ground, we went, we went in, the, uh, in the 12th man and all had two double whiskies just to make sure, basically. <laughs> but the idea was it was meant to level up Chris, but what it did is it just tipped us all oh, over yeah, the yeah, yeah, yeah. There's an obvious flaw in the plan, <laughs> 
Hello Reds, thanks for watching a preview of our video there. If you want to watch the full thing, just click join below and you'll get the full video as well as the rest of our premium package, including all you need before and after every Liverpool game. We'll throw in a few perks too, including discounts at the Anfield App Shop. Get it! So click join, get involved, see you on the other side. Up the Reds.